In round two, our experts have seven questions to choose from, ranging in difficulty from $1 to $7. But those $7 questions are really hard. Each expert will answer two questions, but here they have a choice whether to answer or push. And if they push and their opponent gets it right, their opponent gets the money. Rob, you are the player, the expert with the lowest score. I don't mean to be a player oh, thanks. hater, but <laughs> you... Uh, You're a little off-key, but don't worry about it. Well, that's as well as I can do it. Uh, and, and, uh, but you, you will go first here. Question five. So, Rob, you can answer this question. It'll be among the tougher questions here, or you can pass it to either Blake or Chris. I'll answer it. You're going to answer it. In the category of Notorious B.I.G., four, five dollars. What is the name of the plus-size clothing line Biggie began promoting before his murder that was ultimately launched in 2004 with the help of Jay-Z? The plus-size clothing line. That would have to be... Need an answer. Sean John. It's Brooklyn Mint. Brooklyn Mint. Damn it. That's what happens by being thin, Rob. You have no <laughs> idea. We move now to you, Chris. Why don't you swipe? You get a four right in the middle there. Do you want to answer that question? Do you want to pass it to, to Blake or to Rob? Pass to Rob. Pass to Rob. Here we are. Rob, this is your second and final question in this round. Yeah. yeah. In what North Carolina city was Biggie arrested in 1991 for selling crack cocaine? What North Carolina city? <laughs> Rally. Rally is right. You got it. Four for you. Four dollars. Take That's that. Well see done. You, I'll see your Malta. Blake, go ahead and swipe now. And you got your six. Do you want to answer your six dollar question in Coen Brothers movies, or do you want to pass it over to Chris? Go for it. Be a man. Let's go for it. You're going to go for <laughs> it. What year is on the quarter Javier Bardem taunts a gas station proprietor with in No Country for Old Men? 1980. 1958. Oh, I was going to say six. Sorry. Okay, so Rob, we go to you now. You swipe, and you can't answer a question, but you can pass it to either of your opponents. Okay, little swipeies. Number three, who are you going to pass it to? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with the Siege. We're, we're, we're Siege in Malta here. The six, 1565 Siege of Malta. What English monarch intimated at the time that Christendom itself was at stake in the Siege of Malta? Elizabeth I. That is correct. That's $3. That's that is you, Chris, and you get to swipe easy. right now. Two. It's uh, one of the easier questions. You're going to give it to Blake, or are you going to hang on to it? Pass. Pass it. Blake, this is your $2 question, Coen Brothers Movies. What fictional techno-pop band in The Big Lebowski is based on the German electronic band Kraftwerk? I'm going to take my time here and think, but yes, uh, Autobahn. Autobahn is right. You get two for that. Two big dollars. And we go now to you, Blake, for the final swipe. This question is going to go to Chris. It's his easy mm. question. That's exactly what you wanted. Chris, what pirates used Malta as a strategic center? Uh, the Barbary Pirates. That's exactly right. Known as the Corsairs, but they are the Barbary Pirates. And Johnny you get Depp. a dollar. <laughs> Rob was going to say Johnny Depp, but of course he was out of questions. We'll be back for round three. <laughs>